Aloha, welcome back. In case anyone was wondering where I was, I uh, really haven't gone anywhere. It's just that now that the pandemic is coming to a close and everything's opening up, I'm back at work. I'm doing live event photography and videography, so I haven't really had much chance to make any episodes. Um, as many of you know, I am in the wedding industry, and I most of what I do is weddings, and seems like people that have been waiting literally years to get married all the weekend dates are taken so now I'm even doing weddings on Mondays and Thursdays Friday Saturday Sunday so it's crazy everything open up all at once um, I'm happy to be working but I am tired and you know what I need a cocktail this cocktail is very very simple I took it from the Beach Bum Berry Total Tiki app and it's just two ingredients it's really the answer to the martini if you don't like gin or vodka this simply uses rum in a very interesting liqueur called Kumel. Uh, this is Gilka brand, and it is a Scandinavian liqueur that's flavored with coriander. So let's get right to it. As always, you want your shaker full of ice, and I know you're supposed to stir clear liquids. There's no lime juice in here, but we're going to shake it anyway because we want it nice and icy cold. So we start with half an ounce of the Gilka or the Kumel. Probably pronouncing it wrong, but that's okay. Let me know. Now, if you are not fortunate enough to get products like Havana Club, um, you could pick a substitute. Just pick a lightly aged three-year-old rum. It's just slightly tinged yellow. Like I said, you could probably use a Florida Cana. You could use a Marti. Um, from my friends at Chatham Imports. Um, that's an excellent Panamanian rum. And it's simply just an ounce and a half of that. Two ingredients. It's really hard to mess this up. Make sure you use a jigger. Make sure you measure. Always put your stem cocktail glasses in the freezer a few minutes before so they're nice and cold. Otherwise, especially in this heat, all the, all the uh, humidity and this 90 degree weather heat wave we've been having around the country will just suck the life out of it and suck the chill out of it. And as always, when this gets so cold you can't hold it anymore, or when your fingers start to stick to it, <laughs> you don't want frostbite, then it's probably perfectly chilled. And we are going to double strain this into our martini glass. And this is a super cool martini glass. I got this from Trader Vic's. Um, it's actually a ceramic tiki with a glass. And we just double strain this. And double straining it is you pour it through one strainer and then you want to pour it through the other so we don't get those shards of ice. Are the shards of ice a big deal? Not really, but you want a really smooth, really well-crafted cocktail here. And that is it. That is the whole cocktail. See how simple that was? You want a garnish? Just a lemon peel. That simple. Now, as always, all these recipes are available on my site, but I did borrow this from the Jeff Beach Bumberry Total Tiki app, and it's probably in one of his books as well. Let's give it a sip. Very interesting. You know what I love? I love when you put the glass to your nose, you get that slight scent of the lemon, the essence of the oils of the lemon. Definitely taste the Kumel. And this rum gives it a slightly sweeter, less stark bite like you would get with gin. Um, there's nothing wrong with that. Hope to see you again soon. Cheers, mahalo. Yeah, I could drink this.